today on Nico's Kitchen. An ice cream with two ingredients, made in a blender and no added sugar. Yes, please. We're making my banana and peanut butter ice cream. So just before we start making this ice cream, I just want to quickly go over this first step with our bananas. I got some really ripe bananas and that's super important because it's the ripe bananas are going to give you an extra sweetness with the ice cream. Second thing, I've just cut them up and then popped them in the freezer overnight, but you could do it for three to four hours if you wanted to. And then they come out like ice cubes, nice and frozen. So we're gonna be making the ice cream in a blender and you can use any blender that you want. Obviously, if you've got more of a high powered blender like the one I'm using, it's gonna take less time to do. If you've got a less powerful blender, you're just gonna to have to mix it a few more times to make it nice and smooth and creamy. So very simply, we're gonna be placing in our frozen banana pieces. So now we're going to blend the bananas until they become nice and creamy and smooth. This should take about two to three minutes with your blender. And this is what we're after. Look how creamy this is in here. Look at it. It's like beautiful, smooth, soft serve, and it's really, really sweet. So if you eat this now, it's so, so sweet. You go, oh, this isn't good. So we need something salty just to temper that sweetness. And to temper that sweetness, I'm gonna be putting in some peanut butter. And it will make the ice cream even more rich and creamy and smooth. After adding the peanut butter, blend once more until the peanut butter is incorporated well. It will be smooth and creamy. Now place into a container and freeze for two to three hours or overnight. Now all we have to do is get stuck into this bad boy. at the texture of this. It is so creamy. I love the salty flavor in there. The peanut flavor goes so well with that sweet banana. So texturally it's great. And the flavors are a great balance with sweet and salty. Please give this one a try. It is a must make for you to give this one a go because it's good for you. And you know what? That's pretty good in ice cream and I love it and you will too.